Hello and welcome back to The Note. Having told you yesterday that things were calming down, today we had a veritable car crash. Now, there was concern across world markets, mostly showing itself yet again in lower metals prices, weaker foreign exchange in the emerging markets, particularly most troublingly in Brazil. But perhaps the single most important piece of news uh, was this from uh, this morning's Financial Times, Volkswagen's emission test cheating. That continues to have a drastic effect, not just on Volkswagen, but on stocks of car makers more broadly. As you can see, it's had a very dramatic effect on the share price of uh, autos, auto manufacturers in Europe, possibly the LIBOR moment for that sector. And if we now take a look at how European stocks have done in general compared to the US, you can see that even though uh, the uh, uh, European market entered this year much cheaper than the US, looks still, to, in my opinion, like a very appealing long-term buy. At this point, Europe has managed to underperform the US for this year, even including the impact of the, uh, the dramatic impact of all the QE bond purchases that have come from the uh, ECB. Maybe that is a long-term reason for optimism, but for now, markets are worried about growth and they are particularly worried, once more, about Europe.